We struggled for a while with the name. You want something that's tough, but also something that's fun, and we also wanted it to mean something. We liked the name Liam, and then we discovered that Liam is actually short for William. So Liam is an Irish name, and it's uh, short for William, and Angela's dad's name is William. So we were able to get the family tie in there, as well as a name that we both really liked. His, uh, his middle name is Emerson, after the author Ralph Waldo Emerson. We hope that he grows up and likes nature as much as Emerson did. He was a really great baby in the womb, too. Like, I had a really easy pregnancy. And yeah, he was he was a kicker, but he didn't really kick me like in the ribs, which I hear can be really painful. He was overdue by two weeks. That's the only complaint I have because we were expecting him much earlier. And of course he grew to be much bigger <laughs> since he was in the womb. After Liam was born, you know, they wrap him up and they, they give him to you and and then you're you're kind of just suddenly parents and you're suddenly in charge of this little life. I basically just sat there and just thought to myself, I have to protect him and I've got to be there for him and, and I, I just couldn't even close my eyes, I was so excited. When Angela and I got engaged, Angela's father thought it would be really nice to buy me the exact same guitar that he's had, that he has loved. Then when we got married, uh, the rabbi actually sang a song to us um, during the ceremony on the, and played the same guitar. We hope that he learns to play the guitar and he strums along with uh, his grandpa and his dad and has a good old time. I have loved books ever since I was little, and uh, the library is one of my favorite places. So I really wanted um, to showcase, hopefully, that he's going to love books as much as his mommy does. I hope that he follows in his dad's footsteps and hits the waves. And has a good time and enjoys being outside. And it's hard to say. Like you, there's so many things you want to impart upon your children, and you want them to really, really take after you so much. We want him to read like Angela. We want him to play music and enjoy the outdoors. But he's going to be his own person, no matter what. We're still going to love him.